And welcome back to Root Center Kings 2 Game of Thrones mod. We are back as King Vorian, Dane, the Sword of the Evening. And uh, last time we left off, we were able to get a claim on Ironwood. Um, <clears throat> I was going to keep the guy there, our, our Master of Laws. I was going to keep him there and try to get the uh, Duchy, but like I said, it's not guaranteed. And if our guy is getting rather old, he's about he's 57. Um, just turned 57, so it's not guaranteed he's gonna live long enough for the truce to expire, which is, um, I think it was, uh, August of 7323. So we have a little over a year, so, uh, like a year and a half. So if we can hold out that long, we have a claim on Ironwood, I think. Yeah. And we moved our Master of Law over to World Wild, however you say it. And, uh, that, in that case, if, um, we do get this claim before the truce is up, and it only costs like 70 gold instead of like 150. And then if he dies, we lose those claims unless they're, you know, we're already at war during the time he dies. So it won't be a big waste of money having to spend half. And if we get it, it's just an extra bonus. And then it would literally be the duchy minus one anyways. So, uh, because it's only that, that, and that. He did have more before, but uh, I think Dorn like took this away from him. The, the Scourge, I think, or Ghost Hills. So this guy we're in alliance with. He don't really like us too much. The title claimant, I guess. Yeah, he has Sun Spear. We could give him money, but I'm not gonna waste the money on it. He's got cancer. He's probably not gonna live much longer. Uh, Spotwood is just a regular now. I do want to go for this claim probably uh, next. We have somebody here. I think, she, what is she? Lemonwood. He has a claim on God's Grace. So that's not a bad holding either. Um, somebody else has a claim on this. Planky Town? I can't remember. Or maybe they don't anymore. It was the uh, guy's mom that had the claim on Planky Town. So maybe after getting this, I would like to get this whole duchy just so we have, you know, this whole line going across the top half of Dorne. So all the entry points out of Dorne, the two there are, would have to go through our territory. Uh, we're waiting for this to fill up. It, the levy reinforcement rate is minus 70, so it's like crawling to filling up. Uh, we have roughly two years, a little more than two years uh, until we get rid of those and then the tax... Local tax modifier of negative 30. So this will end up making more money than Starfall will. So when that happens, we'll probably put our uh, master coin over there to collect taxes. Just because we'll get more money, more bang for a buck. We're in a war right now, helping our ally to Stormlands. I kind of want to keep him happy because we have two daughters that are... Well, one was uh, married to a son. She's actually pregnant. She actually got remarried. To another Baratheon. That didn't last long. He wants all my kids. He's not that bad. I mean, he's an incompetent steward, but I mean, he's already treasure. He's shrewd. That's a great. Uh, that's like probably my favorite trait because it's plus two everything. Mm. Let's see. He's recently wed. He doesn't have any. He's not an adulterer or anything. Like she's lustful though, so she's probably gonna have problems. And she's friends with this dude, which means they're probably banging. But we'll see what happens. Yeah, I didn't want to keep him happy. He usually can muster a lot of men, and they eventually usually goes to war with the Riverlands over almost all the Riverlands or a good portion over here. But I think this is the Jor Stormlands. Yeah, that whole duchy is so. What is Stokeworth doing? They're not involved, I guess. This, I think, is part of Trident. Yeah. So, in this time period, the crowns don't exist. What is Manderley doing? Oh, he's at war with the Stormlands, too. See, we're an ally with both of these guys. Let me see them join war. We can't do that because we're with him anyways. Uh... That doesn't make us an ally in that one, though, so that's not bad. Because the Manderleys just came out of the war with the Lannisters, but he's built up his men back pretty quick. So I guess uh, there's something I have to do. Oh, yeah, I want to change out my Master Coin because he sucks. He's a brilliant steward, but outside of that, he's garbage. So I'll put him in there. 
have him collect taxes and Starfall for now. See, right now Starfall is only like one gold a year over uh, Sun Spear. As soon as that negative modifier goes away, it'll be making more. I don't know if I'm gonna change. I think I'm gonna keep him past Final Province. It gives us that five up, uh, five up tickle on the levy size, which is always a plus. Um, I don't see Martell trying to go to war with us anytime soon. Um, at full strength, he still won't have as many men as we do. We're missing almost 3,000 men, so we can get like 17,000 almost. So that's not not bad at all. We just got vassal men raised right now. There was something else I needed to do. I can't remember. Um, there's nothing in here. I do want to construct a flagship when we get the money. Uh, so one of my kids needs something. I can't remember. She is there. Which one is this? Desmarie. Lamore. I think it was a Shara that needed a... No, she has her guardian. I always forget what the hell I need to do. I think everything else is fine for now. Um, man, it pisses me off. I can't think. We don't have any uh, prisoners we can get money for. So I think we're good. All right, we're good. I'm paused. Mm. Oh no, I think there's. I can't think of what the hell I needed to do. All right, these guys are getting out there. We're gonna try to go help out. They got a lot of men between the two of them though. We couldn't just take them on in battle. Since we have 68,000 or 6,800, but we should have another 1,300 somewhere. I don't know why we don't. Um, Corliss is an inspiring leader, but I think we should be leading the army. We're better for old age. He does have a little more modifiers than us. I guess we'll just leave it as it is. The Kodos? Who the hell is that? <laughs> Where's he at? Right here. Uh, yeah, I probably would have him over him. He's got a couple negatives. He's a cavalry leader, just like him. Um, Borman's pretty good. He's the right leader. All right, we'll just leave it as it is. Go up to here. They just took that back, so that's the war goal. Try to get that back so you get the ticking. I hope he's not coming down after us. 22,000 men. I think he turned around. I oh, know he's going that way. Where is all the storm ones, man? Your grace, uh, your son, Prince Edric, is responding very well to my tuition. He's improved in his skills and he's advancing in knowledge every day. Edric's turned out pretty good. So he's got, damn, two diplomacy and he gains humble. Was that one of his childhood uh, traits that turned into that? It's conscientious and willful. Yeah, I think this was fussy. I think he did have fussy. Alright. I mean, it gives you piety. You don't really get anything else. Uh, but he is turned out okay. He's already skill fighter age of 12, so that's great. Let's look at, uh... Oh, yeah. I think my once heir after my son is only 6. Damn, he's already a trained fighter at the age of 5. This is, like, the best uh fighting family I've ever played with. Like, all the... What the hell just happened? Uh... All the kids are like decent fighters so far. Alright, now what's he doing? He's gonna siege that. They're gonna come up here like that way, just in case he tries to come across. We could try to take them out, but he'll come to relieve them if so. Your Septon Septon Layman of Starfall reports that the Septon Layman of Starfall has been humbled by your endless generosity to the poor in Starfall. The peasants are singing your name. That's great. Alright, um, he's just like running back and forth over here. It kinda makes me nervous. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Alright, so he's coming there. They got 8,000 there. Let's sit here for a second and see what he does. Hey, he keeps going back and forth, back and forth. I don't think he wants us to come there. Let's go that way. Um, How many men does he have? Alright, he doesn't even have seven. So most of these are going to be Veilman. How I many? Bale's probably got like 30,000. Why is his capital over here? He's got 21,000. Who has this? A red fort has the Erie. That's odd. Was he a 
His parent, uh, no. Uh, that's what I want to do. Look at happened to the North. The Grey Starks taking over the North as a claimant. All right. I still don't know where Ice is. Um, the High Lord of Winterfell is a Stark. It's the sister of our youngest son's betrothed. Or the brother of our youngest son's betrothed. He's pretty good, Stuart. Um, he's in a war right now for the claim of the North. He has the North... Uh, clans and the white knife helping him. He must have lost some men. He's got him as 9,000. He doesn't have anybody helping him. Uh, he has, she only has 921. What? High Lordship of the White Knife usually has a decent amount of men. Uh, who is the, uh, this guy that has the North Road? So he has a decent amount of men. They should be able to win this. We are, um, Oh, we're not ally with him. We were with the dad. I just don't know how that happened because, like, I know it said he, he took it as a claimant, but, like, still, I don't know how, how many men could he have had unless he had a lot of the realm backing him or a powerful ally. Let's see if he has any allies. No. I don't know how he did that. I got lucky. Alright, so we got non aggression with him. I don't really want to, uh,. As for an alliance right now, hold on. War against the tyranny of Prince Ellard. So he has another war going on. Is what's wrong. Lord Robin of White Knife. Oh, uh, it's about Kalen versus him. So this guy, and then he has who's helping him? Lord Robin of the White Knife. That's King Cregan. That's the White Knife there. Uh, this because he's all right, he's actually Dawn Forest, but because he's the he's married to her, okay. So we're not gonna uh, ally with him right now. He's gonna call us at war. It'd be pointless anyways. By the time we got up there, probably be over. But at least I know he doesn't have that many men. So I don't know why he's just sitting there. Uh, that way we can come up here and try to siege some of this crap down to help him out. That's only got 700 men, so we'll go there. I know he's not going to have any men lurking up there, because he only has about 7,000, and they're all down there. Well, now he's got eight. What was that? <clears throat> I hate that noise. Uh, I'm dead. Uh, he just got beat. What an idiot. You know, he was winning. He needs a little more... Uh, he's probably going to come all the way to where we are. Alright, we siege that. We should probably go for his capital. Yeah. We're gonna do that. Because it might draw him off of uh, being here. So to help him out. I think he, he's not chasing him. He's got the man release too. Tearing into him. Let's see. Uh, damn. He only have 10,000 men now. He fell apart. He had a decent amount of men at one point. I mean, he's trying to get this, so he's probably going to white piece. If it comes down to it. Uh, unless he white pieces uh, the man release. This is a queer, uh, claim for Lord Quentin's claim on Blackheart. So, he probably won't white piece that. He's better off just trying to fight that one, even though he has nowhere close to the men as he does. It's just a one-on-one. -on -one. It's not any other uh, allies involved. Yandri has been a leal and able servant, having successfully completed many tasks in the aid of the Torrentine. It would be seen as right and honorable course to reward him with certain incomes. Uh, yeah, we'll make him a knight. Yeah, that's our master of walls. He really deserves it. So we'll make him a knight. It's cheaper than paying him. All right, what's this guy doing? He must be in another war. Against the tyranny of Lord Lady Bela of the Bay of Crabs. Now, we need to keep track here. Yeah, shit. See, we're going to have to come back because uh, our truce is an assault with him. Yeah, about six months. So we need to get our vassal levies down. Damn, man. I know I shouldn't even got involved in this shit. Alright. Get down here. We're going to worry about our own realm. Don't go that way. Why are you going to go all over close to him like that? 
we'll get them home and then uh that way by the time we get down there it'll be about time we can raise the troops i mean it ain't a big deal if uh they're a little pissy i'll just give them some gold all right master john will shared some of his latest ideas with me i do not know much of medicine but perhaps he is on to something he has asked me for some money to develop his theory further and write a book on it all right 20 gold uh, that makes him a renowned physician then that'll help us oh shit he's going he's going there all right hey, get the hell away from me man all right he's going up there Go down to Princess Pass. Get the hell out of here. We can drop these men. I don't have a, not even a month probably before we can go to war with him. I need to do it like ASAP because of the fact that that claim's gonna go away if we, uh, he's not sieging us. Alright. If that, uh, if he dies. So we have to do it like the day of. Go ahead and drop these guys. Try to let this go down a little. Damn, man. I was hoping he didn't get all the way to 10. Alright, the 23rd, I think, is when we can. Oh, we can do it now. Alright. Let's just let the month go by. Alright. So we're gonna go ahead. Um, trying to think here. Um, we can't call in Stormland. We ain't really gonna need them, but it'd be good to have one just in case. Might be a call manually in because he's really not gonna do much with it. Oh, he's already done that war. So he got black. No, he didn't get black heart. What did he white piece him? Hold on a sec. What just happened? Maybe the guy, uh, you know what? The guy probably died. That's probably what happened. Yup, he died. He had to. It wouldn't just end with no uh, truce or anything. Alright. So it's time to take uh, Ironwood. <laughs> we can get non-aggression. Damn sure ain't gonna go for that. All right, we can get Ironwood. We also have another uh, sandstone. That's this one. What's that look like? It's not bad. We can use those uh, with our son when he takes over. We got Scorch Rock, which we've had. It's not ours, but now I don't know if they'll be able to give. Uh, Armwood as a vassal because he's under him. The other people were independent, so I think that's why that was. Alright, we're going to do that. Let's see what allies we have. Alright, so I think we'll call in, uh, well, if we call in Manderly, we don't need Tarly. We'll call in Manderly. Let's see if, uh, he will honor Ghost Hills. I guess Ghost Hills won't do it. No, he's a little negative now. I should probably give him some gold, but it ain't gonna matter now. All right, I got to go ahead and raise our men. Watch out, girl. I tell you what, these like cats, like every time I'm trying to freaking record something, they always want to be in the middle of everything. All right, um, we definitely gotta raise our own men this time. Raise them. Can we pick them off? No, we don't have enough. Um. Let's see, they're going to Sky Reach, so we're gonna have to take those off. Unless I start bringing them there, he'll probably stop. We definitely gotta get them out. Alright, November 1st, the 30th. So we should stay ahead of them. They're going that way. These guys won't be able to get out. So we'll go ahead and knock them down for now. These guys. You know what now what I'm going to do. I'm going to take these guys and try to take them out. Because they have no morale. By the time we get there, I to be up near hole. Alright. I think I'm going to do like day habit. And put uh, Corley's in the middle. And then Vorian. And then uh. This dude, uh, we'll go up there and take them out. They might turn around and try to come at us, but it'll be all right. Only one of these guys has full morale, anyways. I think. All right, um, they'll stop when they're coming there. Hopefully, 
These guys are going to get out. Let's see what happens. He's still coming. Huh? I thought I told him to come, not him. Did I pick the wrong one? I think I did. He's still a warrior. He's pointless even call. Oh, yeah, he stopped good. All right, they're still going. He turned around and went that way, so they're going to get picked off. We need to go siege out this. So the people that are going here, we will take to Ironwood as soon as... Uh, Samuel Tar is no longer a participant in King of Orange claim Ironwood as his liege, Mandel Marinley Joiner. Okay, that's what I wanted to do in the first place. I guess I picked the wrong person. All right, so we took them out. I guess we'll just sit there and siege that. Um... These guys are going here. They're still trying to come out there. So I think what we're going to do is get them there and come back that way, hopefully. We'll see what happens. Let me see if I take them and just go around. Oh, damn it. Oh, man. Now I'm not going to be able to get a... Fuck, if I drop them now, it's going to make me lose some of them. I'm going to lose half of them. Man, I wasn't even thinking that. God damn it. 13th. You know, I'd rather lose half than all of them. It's not a big deal. Alright, um. They are, uh. That's, yeah, this is our one son, so. He should get, I don't know if he'll give us money because it's his sister. We need a new commander. This guy's pretty good. He has holy warriors, so that really ain't going to help us none. Also make you king justice. New bodyguard. We got a skilled fighter. What do we have this ironborn guy for? <laughs> I don't remember having that guy. Alright, um... Can we ransom anybody? No. Alright. What are these guys doing? Alright. They didn't turn around and try to go after him. He accepts. I don't think we'll get money for her. Yeah, she's already received her inheritance. Her pops is dead. Alright. Prince Tristan Dane has been a legal and able servant. Have successfully completed many tasks. The aid of the Torrentine. It would be seen as right and honorable course to reward him with certain incomes and grants. As sort of foster greater loyalty. Um, yeah, we'll just give them money. Alright, they're sieging this. Let me see, did he buy any men or anything? He had to. No, his levy's just going up. We still have more men than him, and Manderley's will make their way down here. Um, they will have Manderley siege this. Just so he goes that way. If he runs into people, then he does. Alright. Put them together. I need to change these guys now. Um, I think I'll keep Corley's there. We'll go in the middle. Uh, where was that one dude? Borman's pretty good. We'll put Borman in the middle. Put us on the side. And then, where was that one guy at? He's in Starfall. That guy's really good. Uh, we'll put... Shit. And then... Yosef. And over here... I'll put... Uh... What the hell happened to Corliss? Hold on. Did he die? I think he died. Probably why we had to put in a new commander. Shit. Did anybody have a siege? Nope. Alright, whatever. Uh, Yosef would just go in the middle. Or Nakatos, whatever the hell his name is. They can just use one person there. He's sieging. Alright. After we get some more people, we're going to go ahead. We got enough now. Go up here, take them out. That's going to be like 2,000 there. 
uh, put them together even though we lost the uh, progress try to get down here and get him hopefully they're coming down so a raven has arrived from the citadel we should prepare as winter is coming uh, troubling news from battle arm with your grace your courtier sir edison has been captured he was bested in direct single combat by the enemy commander lord trevor jordan and has been taken to scourge as a prisoner the hell who's this dude i didn't even have him as a commander or anything <laughs> Uh, you were separated from your men in the chaos of battle. You now find yourself in the midst of war. As you scan the field and try to rejoin your forces, you see Yandri break through the enemy ranks and charge you. Are you serious? We're both old, so hopefully I don't get my ass kicked. I have a better, way better, uh, what you call it. Get back, your grace. I'll handle this. <laughs> you know what? We gotta fight our own battles. You turn to face Courtier Yandri and breaks his charge and flees. You pursue the loose track in the chaos. Nice. We get extra plus 10 morale. Alright, they left that siege because they knew we were probably going to come after them. They took out those guys. We'll wait till they get there. We're going to just have to keep sieging down for the war score. I knew they were going to ask this shit. A message of ransom. I don't even know who this guy is. I don't even remember having him. He had to be a commander, I assume. Because they're saying I'm down one commander. He wants 10 gold for him. Uh, no. <laughs> He's 62 years old. He's going to die anyways. Um, man, he sucks. Let me see. Let me get some commander real quick. Anybody that doesn't want money. You're 100 years old. Actually, let's do it this way. It takes less time. Yeah, I got a, He's 58. Uh, 19. Alright. Uh, deeply headed today is with the coffers of your loyal subjects are running dry from the upkeep of the levees. You have raised from our lands. Any recompense cost my legions wars would be of great comfort. Uh, 190. Mmm. Feudal vassals are ready to increase. Uh, implement tax shift and nerve obligation. This will take away from levy. I'd rather just pay the money. All vassals are ready to decrease their opinion of my 10. You know what? I'll take the 10. <laughs> I'm losing tax money on this guy. Alright, yeah. Uh, sorry, it's your duty. Doesn't make it go down though, it's the only thing that sucks. If you pay him money or take down a uh, tax concession, it brings down the uh, negative opinion down to, I think, minus one. Point commander. Uh, see just out. He's probably just gonna run back and forth. He's sieging out Planky Town for me. He's probably trying to go for Starfall. Which Starfall has 1153. After we siege this down, we're gonna have to go after him. We can't let our capital fall. That'd be great if he just went after him, but he's probably not going to. You know what? How many men's up here? I'm gonna take this order off. And let him do what he wants since he's down in door now. I'll probably leave that siege because they're stupid. Your grace, the enemy Persian, uh, host of Persian intent on circling the castle. What should we do? It's impregnable. Alright, um. I think I'll go get my family out just to be safe. But we should be okay. Uh, after I siege down the main holding, I'm just going to go after him. But just to be safe, we'll send the family. And then we'll go after him. It looks like he's going that way, so hopefully he does it for me. Master John has published a new theory, and it appear <laughs> apparently it has become the laughing stock of the entire medical community. It is being read as entertainment by scholars throughout the realm. So, again, dull. 
And he lost prestige. Oh, we did too. What the hell? I thought it was just him. Your reports from Starfall, your charity work on behalf is proceeding well. The poor have been fed and your pie standing has improved. Oh, we became a Paragon, Paragon of Virtue. I didn't even know we were doing that one. Uh, we'll go for Wind War. Uh, exalted among men, it's 4,000. We won't get that before we die. I'm surprised I haven't done Wind War yet. All right, loyal servants are not, uh, such as I deserve some recognition and rewards from time to time. It's widely known you hold. No, I'm definitely not giving you high lordship. Eat a dick. He doesn't like me that much, though, man, so it's going to make it negative. It's all right, though. All right, we're almost done here. Why don't you go after him, man? Come on, hurry up so we can get there in time. All right. We'll get over there and take him out. Hopefully, I don't take no attrition on the way there. Let me see if he'll join up with me since he's right there. All right, the ones that were there did. My son. Oh, this is my son. <laughs> He's had a kid already. God damn. Big man. <laughs> He's the same picture as the kid. <laughs> All right. Stephen Dane. That's fine. Some of them are following. We got 14,000 men. We got there just in time. Good. They couldn't assault it, which is great. All right. Master Law. Oh, he died. No. I got to find somebody else. All right. Uh, we can wait to do that because getting claim on his land right now isn't going to matter because we're going to be in a truce. All right. We're at 90. Um, how many men's in sandstone? 1500. Probably better off just going back to Ironwood. Yeah. We're at 90. We got taking war score right now. We need occupation because we're at 75 battle. This asshole. Rescue Garen Fowler from my captivity. He won't end the plot either because he's a dick. Um, it's not a good chance that we get him his sworn shield. Mm. 75. Oh, the hell. All right. We're almost done here. All right, they're taking them out. It's not going to get us any war score. Shit, we got way too many people on it now. Now you guys do what you want to do. Please don't still come there. I mean, what's the supply limit here? 20,000. Alright, they turned around. Why are you going to my land? Alright. Shouldn't take long. This one's probably going to give us enough, though, so we're going to see that couple more shit. They just see something else. Oh, uh, this them. Oh, uh, let's go. Ghost Hill has 11 something. Planky Town has 9, so we'll go there. Alright, during the last few days, my daughter, Princess Desmarais, has not been able to keep any drink or food down. It seems she has suffered from food poisoning. Oh, no. It's bad, too. Alright. Not our physician, because he sucks. I think maybe we should get to take them out so they don't take Lemonwood. Lemonwood has a little over a thousand. We need to put some other people. We have him. They're in or Ironwood. So he's in Spotswood. So we'll put a. Uh, hold on a second. All right. We'll put he there and Axel. Yeah, I knew we were losing. We're missing someone. We'll put him there. All right. The lines have broke down. Oh, oh, she died. Of food poisoning. Bastard. They had a son, though. Alright. We're at 100. All good. There we go. I think we got that. 
Uh, you have successfully seized Lordship Arwen after defeating Prince Dern Martell of Dorne. Shall this territory be attached to the personal domains of Starfall, or shall Lord Yorick Ironwood be confirmed the rightful holder and ensure stability? Yeah, so I'm glad he get to do this, even though he's not uh, under us. If I give him some money, and then if I let him keep his land, he will be even happier too. We're still going to have Furious for five years, and fabricated claims on my land, but that's okay. Yeah, I think we'll do that. If I take it for myself, we get a new administration for five years. Recently conquered for one. I would like to get it to, to give it to my, uh, my other son. Let me see. Prince Edric. Yeah, because he's of age now. I'll be of age a little bit. You know what? I'm just going to take it. He saw it. What? Did you serve the lordship of Vulture's Rest? Uh, Roost. He took Vulture's Roost. Oh, I wasn't thinking. He probably could have did. Fuck. He probably could have put all that under him. But then again, I don't think so. How would he be able to take all that with him? I don't know. Damn, I hope I didn't screw myself with that. If he could have taken all this and put it under us, that would have been great. I guess we'll try it next time if we get to somebody else. Maybe I'll move my Master Laws to Hellholt. And then try that and see if he takes the whole uh, duchy if you give him the vassal. Damn, that pissed me off. I didn't know that was going to happen. Alright. When's our son turn 16? Mm, my happy year. We gotta wait for this war to end so we can call our damn kids out of Harding. Alright. Um. I guess let's do... Exalted among men. Alright, so we'll go ahead and end this here. Man, that sucks. Um, yeah, so I think I'll do that. I'll move Master Lulz to Hellholt. And if we do that with him, we tell him to defeat, like, let him be our vassal. We'll take the whole duchy since he's a duchy holder. Man, I didn't even think of that. I should have. Damn it. it pisses me off now. <laughs> Alright. Well, uh, leave a thumbs up. Subscribe. See you in the next one. Later.